Well, hello. It's the end of Timikulu. Talk about Aitanya for a young second. I watched it like a few days ago now. Mago Ruby really did a transformation. I mean, like, there's a mirror scene where it's like haunting. Where she's trying to calm down and stop herself from crying. The smile. Like, they tried their best. She still looked adorable as hell, no lie. But they tried their best to, you know, take away from take her away from the image of too pretty to be taken seriously it was a good movie i mean like like disaster artist it's a true story very dramatized and hard to believe that it's true you know i really enjoyed it like the outcome of it seemed warranted but i even heard that people are saying at that movie is trying to make her seem innocent and all this and trying to make her seem nicer than she truly was and she went back to her true colors because she was trying to sell something I don't, remember, I don't know really know what but let's talk about my my man went to soldier that dude was amazing in that role like the fact that he made me stop thinking it as him as Bucky Barnes <laughs> showed you how great he was. Even the woman for mom, I don't know the names per se, but the performances were fantastic. Even the bodyguard, dude. Oh, there was an actual, they even showed actual footage of a dude who thought he was that, he was what that dude thought he was in the movie. Like, he thought he was smartest human being on the planet. I really enjoyed the movie. Start rating them and give it an 8 out of 10. Yeah.